Hello guys and welcome back. In today's video I will be doing our loud content and that is Fair Play Arena. So so yeah. So like like we got we start this week with Sewell that random hero that I don't even know that she existed and we got Lele Sting Justy that's Justy then we got Wim and we got Reeves and obviously like we got crap heroes here uh, maybe 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 him but I'm not so sure about it so let's refresh it and we got all cuts perfect and then and then the other people you'll get like Henge, Esther, Belle, Agatha and stuff so it's 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 RNG arena, not fair play arena, first of all. So alright, let's let's buy Ulcaster. And let's set teams like this Reeves I I guess her and I have no idea what she does. So alright, let's put her in. Let's do like this. Alright. So now we're gonna go to the battle. Like we got a random teams that is not even full so yeah we obviously gonna win that one now we keep going then again we will not face full team yet all right so, and who do i buy like who can i possibly buy i guess Bisdin and tifia so all right let's let's buy tifia let's put tifia in instead of that hero Alright, if I is in. Alright, alright. So, we finally got full, full team. And now le let's check stats of those heroes. Alright, alright. Let's check stats. So, Ulcaster. 45k. I mean, it's solid. But like, crit rate is 70%, which is, I guess, solid. Crit damage is solid, not that great. And effort hit 50% is somewhat okay. Let's check Lucifer. So Lucifer got as well 45k attack. But like, so crit, so Lucifer got more crit damage than Woolcaster. Same effect hit. L, right. Then we have. But like, why, why on earth would Sewell go before, before Ukas? Because in theory, in theory, you want, so, Lela go first, that's as expected, then Wim, that's fine as well, and then you would ideally want Ukaster to put defense down, and Tenacity down, and then you go with Sewell to, to, to like, uh, kill them. Even though Sewell puts alright as well as uh, defense down, but like you want Ulcaster into Sewell, not Sewell into Ulcaster because it makes zero sense. Like why? Let's and Tiffy, like what? What is this? Like why? Why on earth would you want 66% crit rate? Like if it's if it's Lucifer, it's okay because due to his passive he'll get plus 30% crit rate when he's under stealth. But, uh, but, but Tifia, no, Tifia doesn't get any boosts of her crit rate from anywhere. So, like, it makes zero sense for her to have 66% crit rate. Then, uh, alright, Wim is fine. We got, we got uh, Reeves, that's also decent. But, like, I still don't get why would Sewell be faster than Ulcaster, it makes zero sense. Alright, so we boosted, alright, alright, alright. Then we're gonna put defense down. We're gonna buff. Alright, and now we will do that. And like, he can't even. Alright. <sighs> alright. And now I wouldn't be surprised if we'll, I mean we will we will not lose only because like Ulf Kastler got CC but otherwise we would have lost. And all right, and let's buy mm, let's buy Bison. Let's see what are his stats. 
because like I can't get more surprised and I'm surprised already so do we want a sea in first team? I mean I, I don't really care about it so we'll, let's keep him in, for in first team or other team one <coughs> Uh, let's keep it. Can we get a decent team? Ah, uh, so we got Katrin and Yoko. Ah, uh, let's let's see. Uh, so let's. So it look like speed of Bison is, is fair enough. So like you want him fast, so that's fair. Katrin, you want Katrin fast as well, so that's also good. Yoko again, that's six percent crit rate. Hard duck. All right, all right. And like, what does he do? And like, he's a support. He's supportish type of heroes. And he's under 2k speed. Meanwhile, uh, Sewell is DPS hero and he got 2400 speed. So, can someone explain me how, how on earth? How on earth? So, yeah. Uh, let's do that. Even if they will counter attack, so it make zero sense for me to do that let's just now let's freeze them and I have no idea what this Lele does but I still don't need that yeah, let's him AOE but like she deals zero damage like she deals zero damage uh, let's Alright, now... Can we... Thank you, finally! Finally, so this is the only reason why I liked Woolcaster back then, because like that extra turn when he inflicts a kill is a good thing all right so first thing so first off we got Lucia then we got Lucaster so let's refresh it and all right all right so we will get the jingle bell all right so all right let's let's check Madalena stats So why on earth she has uh, for 47k attack and Lucifer and Ulcas got 45k attack? So why? Why is why does she has why does she have higher attack than Ulcaster? And also what does why does she have more crit damage than Ulcaster? Like how? All right. That being said, let's do this. Let's hope. All right, I guess. I guess that's balanced. Anyway. All right. All right. All right. All right. Perfect. So we need one more win so I can get Bell, Bella. Oh yeah, and about this, so also this, so I'm gonna lose this, obviously, but look at this, look at this, so, so Ben Austin is the fastest hero, or rather f the, fa the sh he got the, f the fastest uh, base speed in Fair Play Arena, which is 2830, like how, like how? Then we got Donald Rebelli. So like he got 40k attack, like ha, like it makes zero sense. It makes zero sense. But anyway, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna 
do that. I'm gonna give her ins. And like I'm dead very well. Alright, let's I need either a win or a lose now. I don't bother, I will just skip it. I lost that's fine, I don't really care. Now let's get let's buy Bella. Uh here Alright, so let's put Alright, so we're gonna do it like this. So watch this. So in theory, in theory, in theory, we got uh, Lele to boost. Then Ulka should go before uh, Jingle Bella, so uh, he increases her attack and puts defense and tenacity down on enemies. So that's how it should work, right? So let's see if it will work like that. Let's see. Uh, so we get Lucy, Lucy, we get Lucy for yet again, let's see. But, like, why, <laughs> like, why would you want Bella to go before Ulkalser? Can someone explain that to me, please? Like, I, either I'm dumb and I don't under understand, so you should build heroes that you first use DPS and then you put uh, defense down and tenacity down, which makes zero sense. So it, it makes zero sense. It makes totally zero sense to make Bella faster than Ul Ulcaster. So simply make zero sense. Like it makes zero sense. So what are her stats? So yeah, so 42k attack and she had 70 70 percent crit rate and she had 260 crit damage which, which is so low like 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 so so this is FPA Bella and this is my Bella so 52k attack we got almost 100% uh, crit rate as it should be and I got like almost uh, 300 crit damage with decent amount of effect hit I mean it's not really that matters that much but like and obviously she is around 180 speed because I need my other here at the uh, heroes in the team to go before her like that's how she should be built like attack crit rate and crit damage and then you can either choose if you want more attack or crit damage but apparently in fair play arena you want her to be as fast as possible like she is uh like she is uh, the support hero and not the dps hero so like it makes zero sense it totally makes zero sense but very well let's do one more attack and then we are done for it and i will just skip it because i can't watch it and i won good Alright, so I lost one, I lost three, which I don't really care about. And so let's see what does this, so, like, see, so Asindo, Little Jack, and Lydia, we got Quinland, Asindo, Nerid, Donald, and meanwhile, I got shop with Lucia, shop with Ulcaster, and then I got Jingle Bella. So I got one good hero, which is not even built correctly, so I can't even use her. And the other people get like uh, Henge, Lydia, Nerid and stuff like that. So it's not fair play arena, it's RNG arena. And I have been saying that since day one, that it's luck based. It has nothing to do with skills or anything. It's just luck. If you get, if you get Henge, if you get Henge, Donald and Lydia, like obviously you're gonna <laughs> win it because like it's it you can't beat that. 
So, yeah, it's totally fair play, or rather RNG Arena and not fair play Arena. But on the bright news we got Lucky Will and I will be able to get my E2 Esther. Oh, 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 damn, that's actually... Hold on a second, hold on a second. Let's let's finish this video on positive note. So let's ho hopefully I will get nice, 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 nice. Will it go to the Nita? I got that. Nah, most likely not. It will go on. I, I will find user for this piece for sure. So yeah, so yeah guys, that's pretty much it and I will see you guys in next one.